Hey, how you guys doing? Welcome to the channel. It's your boy Ray254 Adventures. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys go hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell. Today we're here in a cool abandoned location called Slanton Far. I was actually given this location by one of my cool followers. Shout out to him. His name on Instagram go by FWS710. I'll put that down below. If you guys want to check him out, he do take some cool pictures out here in nature also. So I could go check him out, follow him, show him some love. But we right here going to check out this cool location he sent us. It's actually my first time. And now we're going to see what has to bring. So if y'all guys are interested, I'm um, tag along and we're gonna see what we can run into. So let's go. So guys, we just got in and it looks like it was a road here. And there's all these like farm looking houses here. This is the Slayton farm. And just right here on the side of me, it looks like this right here was like a greenhouse. It's gonna be the first thing we're gonna walk in to check out. Hopefully no animals or anything jumps out. Just look at this. It's an old cool farmhouse. What's left of it? And I'm, I don't know how secure this thing is, but this is our first little building we're attempting. And there's a lot more around this whole area here. Trust me, there's a lot of buildings that we're going to be going around and checking out. And shout out to my guy for um, giving me this location because this is a definitely cool location. Um, it's probably one of the best ones I went to so far, especially with all this stuff all around that I've seen. I'm not too sure we could get into any of these things, but we're going to find out today. Just walking right here inside this little greenhouse showing y'all guys this. But that's all it um goes to right here to this dead end here. And look, you can see like a little light still up there. It's so cool. We're gonna be turning back. Go we'll check out the rest of this place here. So I was walking by these um rusty little looking dusts here. Oh, this floor is like real tilted in this corner here. It actually goes down, but it's in bad shape. You're not going to be going down there. There's probably nothing down there. Let's go out through here. Go back out to this road. See what we could run into. So I could go down this way right here. There's a whole bunch of other buildings down there. But I'm actually going to take a look over here. See what this road um, goes towards. Look at that building over there. Got a nice little balcony. I hope we can get inside those. But just out here on the side of me is a whole bunch of like other little farms. And everything over there is just all abandoned. Can't wait to go to some of these buildings here and check them out. And look at this. This right here got to be the school. Look at this. It's like a brick wall here covered up by nature. Make sure we don't get no scene right here. So this is the front. It's fire, super dope. I'm gonna run across here. You can see some workers over there on the other side, so we don't want to get seen or anything. But you know what? We should be good. As long as we don't go into these buildings here, in front of them, saying so we'll go when they're not looking. <laughs> Just look at this building, it's all boarded up. So I doubt we're going to be able to get inside this one here. I'm trying not to get caught neither. It's a lot more that we got to explore over there. Just look at this little porch that go up. Let's go up it. So this thing is just crazy. You can see somebody trying to get in there. All this stuff just crazy left behind. This whole property is a nice little beautiful landmark here. I hope we can get into one of these buildings at least. I know this place got a lot of like visitors that come here. Um, when I first came in here, I seen two other people that was walking towards the other way. But they was doing the same thing, just exploring. I kind of uh, kind of got scared, thought it was gonna catch us and um, kick us out of this little area here. Whew, I thought I heard something coming in. But just look at this. All this just abandoned. I don't know what they're going to be doing with this place. I really don't know too much history. Well, I don't even know no history of this place. I just know that it was a school here. But it's a lot more than a school, as you can see with all these buildings here. But it's definitely dope. 
I'm just um experiencing it just the same way y'all guys are seeing it. So y'all guys don't gotta come here. But if y'all guys do wanna come here and see it for yourself, it's definitely a cool spot here. I'm not telling y'all guys to come here and get yourself caught up here because this is prior property. But I am saying this is a cool location. And just over here would have been some set of stairs that went up to the building. I'm trying to see if I can find my way into one of these buildings, but obviously I can't because everything is boarded up. It's another way over here I'm going to go towards. This would have been a cool building to go into. But it looked like they just boarded it up. It's a fresh piece of wood right there on the door. And I'm just walking a little pathway. But people would have been walking by when this place was all open. And I don't, I'm not too sure what these buildings right here was. I just seen a couple pictures of it. And I um, decided to come here. Once my um, friend showed me this location here. And kind of gave me the um, pinpoint to this place. So shout out to him. It's definitely a cool spot. I see some group of people over here also. So this is a cool, I guess, hangout spot around this area here. A lot of people come here. But there goes another group there. I see another group that's on that side. Everybody out here just seeing these cool buildings left behind. Especially in this beautiful day. It is nice and sunny. The only reason I'm wearing this mask is because, you feel me? I see a lot of cars that was parked up there at the parking lot. And, um, I didn't want that area to be polluted or any stuff with well, all this corona stuff going around in the air so i mean safety first you got to be secure as we continue walking over here see this cool rusty basketball court here this definitely would have been another cool building to go into there goes a um, group of people that we seen a few minutes ago one of the groups and it's just like all these buildings just left behind. It's crazy. I can't believe this all stuff just left here. It looks like over here we can get into some of them because I see a doorway open. But I'm just checking these out from the outside. Definitely dope. I think it was the other two that was over there. I thought it was more people. It was actually just them two. So there is people here. I'm not the only one here exploring. I know I'm trying to get to where that church was at because I seen that church and I think that's right there. I got to get over there. I got to because I seen it on the side of the road. I was like, I got to check that out. And hope, I hope guys, I hope guys it's a, a damn opening to that church because I want to get in that church so bad because it caught my eyes when I was on the road. And uh, I can't wait to show you I want to get up there because you can see a little bit out there. But when we get close, it's going to be a different story. I'm telling you, the structure of that thing is amazing. I love the stonework they did to that building there. It's not even a big little church. Well, a big church is a little church, but it's still amazing. I can't wait to get over there and show y'all. Just look at this. So another row here. Hold on, this is the same row. We had to continue down straight earlier, but we turned to go behind that building. Kind of get myself lost here, but it's still cool. Are we still enjoying it? Look at this. Bang the road. Cars would have been coming through here. Kids would have been coming to school here. Whatever them buildings in there, people would have been working, living. Whatever they do. But this is a cool spot, I'm telling you. And I can't even, can't, can't even um, thank my homie enough for this spot. Because this is more than one banded location. This is like... I don't even know how many. It's a whole bunch all over, man. They just scattered all over. But it's definitely dope. And those basketball courts left all the way over there. Just rusted up. Nature took it over. I need to go over there and take a shot of that. I need a picture of that. I was trying to get over here to see if we can get inside that building and show you guys the church over there. But just look at this. Nature taking over this basketball court. Just look at this. It's a rusted basketball court. And there's a tree that took over it and is um slowly by slowly getting connected with the tree but there's another cool building over here that i seen an opening to that we're trying to get into 
this one over here i don't see any opening but we will find out once we get over here to the front of it we're right now on the side of this building so let's go over here and see what we can see in these just got back here to the road and over here i can actually see an entrance going in here to this building i'm not too sure it's gonna lead us inside or anything but it's another building over there that would, that's the building we're checking out i thought there would have been an opening over there but i don't see anything either but we're still gonna go check it out first let's check this one out here so as we go in you can see the old sign just up there all graffiti up and then we can't go nowhere inside this building they blocked it off from over there it's another door this way but it goes to nothing but the back so we're just gonna go back this way look at the little type right in here but let's go back over here see if we can see anything else let's go towards the church now i don't know it's like something was here you can see like a little circle little round thing here part of it like a little fountain or something They border all these buildings up real good. Um, hopefully we can get into one of them. I know my homie got into one of the buildings. I know he sent me some pictures when he was in one of them. So it probably is the other side, one of the other buildings I've seen. So we're gonna go towards over there in a few, but we wanna check this church out that I've been talking about. So let's walk over here and let's um, check that thing out. Let's walk into it. Just right there in front of me. You can see like little um, trailers over there. They all boarded up. But here goes the church guys I was talking about. I hope there's a way inside this thing somewhere. But just look at this building. This building is so amazing. The stonework all around it. It was built in 1964 it says right here on the side. Walk up to that show y'all. So just over here you can see the date. Right next there on a little cute right there let me see if i can get around all this stuff here it's like a whole bunch of woods with nails so i'm not trying to get poked but just right here 1964 i think it's the old church you see some of them stained windows behind the um wood there fire super hot actually walking around this thing showing y'all just a big open field right here it's the back you can see somebody try to get in here also he ain't thought this stuff open they tried but they couldn't get in See all this stuff they threw here I guess to block people from going in there. It's like a worker all the way over there on the other side, so you gotta kinda be on a low here. But they're actually working on a road that's on the side of there. I'm trying to see if there's any way that I could get in here. It's definitely be so fire to get in. See uh, this way here. It looks like somebody trying to go in through here, but now nah, they board this thing up. Yeah, they board that up. Just kind of go back over here a little bit, trying not to get caught. Ain't no way inside of the church, but it's still cool checking that out. Let's go see the other buildings over here. So we came from going straight, so I'm turning and going towards this way to the left. Start making my way to this way over here, see what we can run into. I felt like there was a factory over here also. So here goes whatever this was, like a factory. Saw this cool graffiti on the outside of it. Everything looks boarded up there also, so 
I thought it was gonna be way inside of there. He got like this cool um eagle. I guess that was a logo. This would have been like another door here. They boarded up. This is prior property. Walk around and see if there's another entrance or something. I see like this big tower that's over there. That would be super dope if we could get to that tower and go up in and see this whole village from the top of that and the video up there. That would be amazing. Uh, we're going to try that out. Hopefully we could because it looks like we're going towards that direction. I'm just walking around this um, building here. I'm not too sure what this building was, but I'm just walking around see if there's any other entrance here. Let's see if we keep going. I've been checking all the buildings that we've been passing by. And I haven't seen no entrance into none of them yet. I mean, this place is real, real, um, boarded up real good here. This grass is hot too. And just here, there ain't nothing either. There's a door that was here before. And that's boarded up. Let me just keep walking and see if there's anything else on the other side here. But uh, right there would have been a doorway. We boarded it up though. And that's it. Yeah, I might as well just go back around this way. Make my way out of here. There's like another door here. They boarded that thing up too. So I'm back here on the path. Following this road that's here. You can see the um, light pole up there, a banded light pole. I don't got no light or nothing on it. So, there goes the tower right there now. You can barely see it, but it's right there. I'm gonna try to see if we can get tours over there. I see some graffiti on it. That is a scary little height to go up to the top, but if we can climb it, we might do it. So, let's see. Let's finish checking out the rest of these buildings here. There's another little building coming up to right here to the side of me. This walk right here is a little path. You can see a basketball court here also just left behind. This one not too bad with the nature taking over. I was just coming up to the building closer. You can see a window over here. It looked like people actually went up through that window. I'm just gonna kind of um, snoop around the building first before we attempt any crazy thing. I actually see another building up here with the door wide open. We won't be going inside that one, I know that. And look at in here. Just about to pass this and this is open. Ain't nothing here but like a little machine room, I guess. Oh yeah, they close this door up. Got some like nails and stuff. It's crazy. Let's go back out here. I thought that was gonna be a way in. All this stuff is just cool being left out here. Like somebody made a way in. Inside this way. Let's check this one out. This way's open. Whispering the whole time, going in 
inside his building here. goes up. I'm gonna check out this floor first. stairway that went to us over here. And I'm trying to take them stairways up. It was just over here. Let's see where this thing takes us to. Kitchen or something. You guys see all like the stoves. Tables here. Yeah, that goes up more. Go up. Let's see what this goes towards. Super trash, these rooms. Look at this picture. Cool. 
magazines here. Chicago versus the Sixers, I think that is. One over here. Nothing in these rooms. Should have been like a bathroom, I guess. The same way I just came from. I think it was up to like an attic up there. But the roof's in bad shape, so it's part of all messed up up there with birds. Walk over here, look at this. Gotta be careful with this floor though. It's a nice balcony here. Just look at this, gives you a nice view of this place. Is that a balcony? It's because looking at from the bottom. And look at this, some old books here also. There's a whole bunch of them. All like school books. We just look at this view out this window here. We just got done coming through all that. Hopefully, we're gonna get seen from right here. I'm just showing y'all guys this thing is amazing. Let's give y'all guys this view before we head out of here. Hopefully, this floor holds us up. You gotta head towards this direction once we get out of here. So this is the what we're gonna be heading towards. Let's get out of here. Let's go check out the rest of this building here. It's going down this hallway here. Some more beds. Looks like somebody was sleeping in this one. This is the bathroom. Yep. It is. It's an office desk. And it's still got the little um link. See the little link right here. This is fire. And then continues on down this hallway. Straight down. I'm gonna finish this little section first. No fire extinguishers have been there. And just when I thought we couldn't get into none of these buildings, we ran into this one. What is this? Oh, there's a little stairway going down. Gotta be 
careful with this floor. It feels kind of um, wobbly. Look at this. No storage. Just got nothing but a few pillows. These are like bathrooms. This would have been the mirror. This might be feeding right on it. It's going towards this way. We have a bird inside this place here. Probably over there. It's like another little balcony. Set up real nice this room. Got the bed, the chair right there, looking out the window. I don't know what the heck is that, probably construction people. It's like a doorway here. So this thing is shut, you can see. We got like another like wood there. So we're going back towards this direction. Just going back over here. I see it continued on on this way. That's where he was at over there with the little office table. This was here. You could tell there was a TV here. A little TV mount. So this would have been probably like the little chilling area. Yeah, I don't know, you can actually see a trunk board here. And there's like a little window here with a fence on it. This the other side. <laughs> what we just looking at? You see like a sink. and dryer and stuff. This door kind of like moved by itself. To another data, it'd be another exit here, but it's blocked off. And head back towards over here. Just walking by through all the stuff again. When I walk by this room here, I actually see some books, so 
Let's take a look at them books. A few nice school books here. Probably some of y'all could remember some of these books. There's a lot more stuff in there. I don't want no bird or anything to jump out of this thing here. But there's a whole bunch of like books here. I don't know if you guys ever read any of these. Definitely looks old though. here making my way out of this building I had like one more floor but that's more like a little attic and I'm um, that car like bird bird um, home up there let's take a look I look at this window here yep so downstairs just leads to that little attic up there I know there's some crazy stuff in there This is where that balcony was that I was um, checking out. This goes up to that attic I was showing y'all. I'll take a look up there and just show y'all. But we're now gonna go all the way up there. Oh, it's in bad shape, so we ain't gonna be able to walk up here. I still show y'all. Just look at this. I'm not walking on that. Definitely scary though. Boarded up down there. It looks like it was a door, but it boarded it. So we here, I didn't check this out. This floor is real spongy. Doesn't feel like the safest thing to be walking on. shelves I don't know what this was here you see somebody's own shoe here they had a rebox the classics So that's basically he just took us all around. Looks like little offices. And it's like a chalkboard here. Nothing. Just gotta go back around. Some tables, was it? Just 
walking through here. That's what we came at earlier up here. Oh, somebody else exploring over there. Kind of scared the hell out of me. This is where all the tables was. They didn't get to check out this section. You can see the long tables here folded up. Some more over here. This would have been a big lunchroom. Keeps going. And over there, it's just all bad. The roof just collapsed on the other side. So we're just gonna be turning back. There ain't too much to see here. Look at the colors of the um, little benches here. Just going back over here. This is where the people was at. Just back here at the kitchen. You can see all the machines here. I should have brought my other light because this light right here I got is horrible. It's probably hard to see anything here. My other light would have light this whole thing up. It's the way I came from. Freezers and stuff here. Some more equipment. Let me show you guys that. It's the other side of the kitchen. This would have been an exit here, but they blocked that off also. And this way they blocked off also too. So we gotta go down. This is the way we came up, which is coming out the same way. And now we outside. Shut this light off. And now we check out the rest of this place here. It's definitely was cool inside this building. Look at this. Dang, that's a crazy hole that just dropped straight down. Sewer line. That building was scary, <laughs> but it was definitely cool. Even though it was really um all turned up and stuff, but just knowing that how old it was and the history on it, and like knowing that it was like a school or whatever it was, but knowing people was there, doing things there, living there, I mean, it definitely was cool, but. There's a lot more stuff out throughout here. Here goes another one. Well, this is the same building we were just in. This is the one side. We were just looking out from up there. The balcony's on the other side behind it. So this road kind of goes this way. This goes towards the tower. Or we could continue on going up this way to get back where we came from. So. I might just go this way for now. Head towards this tower. That building was so cool coming out that thing. So we're right here now, closer to the tower. You can see basically under, underneath the tower. And you know, there's this building here that's collapsed right next to it. Just gonna take a look at that. Rubble home here and just collapsed. Everything just buckled in. But that's a tower up there. There's a little path going over here towards the tower. It's 
big tower. It sucks because somebody um knocked the steps down here. You see right here, there would have been some steps going up to the top of the tower. And um, they cut them things so nobody could climb it. This is that one building. We're just walking around there showing you off in the back of it. Since we're here, might as well take a look. And it actually wraps around so we can get out through here also. Look at this one, got a little opening you can look inside. Ain't nothing left there. Just a couple of old like rusty machines over here in this corner. And a whole bunch of like shows just throwing around. Oh. This place got all these abandoned buildings. I wonder what happened here. If anybody knows what happened here, please, please guys let me know in the comment because I want to know myself because this place is such a cool little property here. I don't see why they um let this place get abandoned like this. And look, this would have been, I don't know, storage or something? Because it's the lockers and stuff right here. And a whole bunch of like old stuff right there just thrown around. Same thing with these. These are all like little shed type of buildings here. Nothing really left in them. Just gonna take a quick look through all of these. Since we in this corner, we might as well. It's like some other trail that goes over here to like this other building back here. This goes to like this building here with like these machines. Kind of look like pumps. Oh, this is super cool, guys. It's like a little pump station, I guess. Got these set of stairs going up here. Show you guys. This thing is nice. You had to be kind of short to be up here because the ceiling ain't really that high. Look at it. Right here. And I got to kind of dip a little bit because now my head will be hitting. Me. So you got to be like a small person to be working in this little section. bottom down there ain't really nothing too much there so we headed back out here continue back onto that road so it looks like it would have continued on over there but they blocked it off with all this um like trees and stuff they just threw it out blocking the road and stuff so i'm just heading back over here getting back onto the um, path he was on and i'm walking that thing back around That's where we just got done coming from all this stuff here. Just following this little paved path. Just going back where we um before we turn to go check out this tower here on the side. I wish we could have went up there and ended the video from up there. That would have been real cool. But we're just gonna follow this road here. There's a few more other buildings going towards the direction where the car is at. So we're gonna be heading towards over there. And um, hopefully we can get into another cool building. But if not, we still have fun here, walking around this little property and checking out that one building that we got to got into. But we still had an amazing time. And then we're just hiking, continuing this thing on. Seeing what else is here. It's starting to heat up now like crazy. It was supposed to go up to like 70 degrees, but with the sun out, whew, making it even feel hotter. Passing back this building if he was in. It's like another little trail that goes right here. There's like another building that's back over here. See if we can go in here and check this building out, see what's inside of it. Just gotta go through all this debris. We made it over here. See like another entrance over here that's open. Hopefully all these um, bushes and stuff ain't in our way. 
with this whole little cassette player. <laughs> Almost right, right by there. I don't know what this building is, but we're about to find out. We're about to go in. So we have another classroom, I guess, here. Yeah, this is going another classroom. All the school stuff just still here, left behind. You can see like an old computer here. A typewriter. Maybe. And some books. And these papers. I haven't seen these papers since I was a kid. Crazy. See what's over here. So this right here will actually show us more that this was a school. A lot of stuff left behind here. That roof just collapsed right there. This one would have been a little um, shelf here. You see some of that stuff still on it. This would have been another one here. So this one's in bad, bad shape. Look at this though. Somebody really came here and stuck all the chairs on the wall. Super dope. It's creepy but fire at the same time. I gotta get a picture of that. And if you guys wanna see all the pictures that I take from all my locations and stuff, y'all can also check those out on my Instagram, Rates about Four Adventures. I usually put those up on there. So you guys can go check those out if y'all wanna see all the pictures. I'm just snooping around real quick before we go. And um Take a picture of that. Look at this. An old sewing machine. A brother's sewing machine at that. It's not a regular cheap one. And this thing is in kind of good shape here. Got the machine just underneath it. It's a little paddle you would step. And it still moves. This thing is crazy cool. I'm taking a picture of that. Awesome. <laughs> Here, this would have been a classroom. This side is all bad. Just collapsed down the floor. Now let's head back towards this way. Just back here in the hallway. I'm gonna continue walking this thing on. Hopefully this floor doesn't buckle down on us. It's like people just went crazy, just smashing chairs against the wall. These are always classrooms. As you can see, they got the chalkboard and all the um, dusters and stuff. I'm just continuing this thing around here. This goes at that end. Nothing in this building really. There's a big chalkboard right here in the ground that we step in. It's one of the movable ones that you can just move all around the classroom. We came in from this way over here, but I want to take it up on this corner before we get out of here. Hoping we didn't miss anything in this building. Just gotta make my way around all 
lot of stuff here. When we came in, we went in through that way. Through this doorway here. But now we're making our way out of it. So we done with that building. Just walking over here. See what it takes us to. We come towards this parking lot here. Whatever this was, you can see nice and lines underneath it. Alright, I'm trying to go up through here and find a way to get back out in front of this building. It's right here, got to the front of it. And it looked like it was a garage here. The building we just came out of this one here but this right here is like a garage it's all turned down head back towards this direction Oh, these are locked so we can't get in those. Here was another little basketball court. Keep walking this path here. This is going to take me to the direction where I first started at. So I'm actually going to take this little road here. So just right here is like another house here. Everything looks like it's boarded up from here. But there's another one in front of me. I'm going to take a look at this one first. If anything, we're going to come over here and check this one out next. This is a nice house right here. Just left here. I'm not too sure you could go inside of it or anything. The front, everything looks boarded up. Somebody looks like they're trying to make a path here. I'm going to kind of walk it to see if there's any entrance or anything over here. I doubt it though, but we're going to check out, see if we see anything, hopefully there is. So this is actually taking me to the back of the house. And um, I don't think there's no entrance here. Nope. Everything is boarded up. But it's definitely still cool checking in the back out, seeing how it looks from the back. There's a lot of thorns here, so cut me all up. <laughs> Making my way back out of here. Look at this. An old barber chair here. Somebody was a barber here. So I can actually see the parking lot up here. Where we parked at so we just went back around and then um, this the way right here where the greenhouse was at we were checking that out over here there's a couple like little barn type of looking things here Let's take a little peek through them so these are the barns here i was talking about probably take a little look through here see what it looks like get the light out and um, they just use this for storage. You can see like the lockers and stuff over there. Some of the beds. And all that other stuff over here like the windows. I'm going to continue walking over here a little bit. Before we turn back. Just continuing this thing straight. This is where the towers at on the other side. It looks like something's over here like another building. I'm going to check that out. So here goes the house that I was seeing from up there. It's all taken over by nature. I doubt anything will be open here. A lot of stuff will board it up.
Oh, dang. Birds get the heck out of me. That just right here would have been like a porch. Ain't no way in though. They blocked it all up. And that bird scared the heck out of me. I'm always getting scared by them damn birds. They be popping out of nowhere. It's not the basketball court here. Nature's taking over. Somebody actually um, owned the property on this side here. It says no trespassing. Be aware of doll. But we just heading back towards over here. Heading back to the car. Just making our way out of here. But I'm about to wrap it up here. My battery's starting to die out. I didn't bring um actual little charger with me. The little charger I brought was only halfway full. And um that actually died on me. So I'm actually making my way out of here. Lucky we got to uh, film most of the stuff here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I definitely had an amazing time. Um, but once again, shout out to my guy for hooking me up with this location. Um, and um, I really appreciate it, man. And I hope y'all guys enjoy watching. But I'm about to wrap it up here. So if you guys want to see more, make sure you guys turn on the notification bell. And I'm um, go subscribe if you haven't subscribed. And um, go check me out, man. And um, show your boy some love. But I'm about to wrap it up here. See you guys next time. So peace. And I'll see you on the next adventures.